Imagine a crocodile just came out of that swamp. Right, here we go. Guys, 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 guys. <laughs> <laughs> In here's a bit of rattlesnake, guys. What a great hole, nice bogey anyway. I really like bogeys. Minimum in the mental, minimum in the mad. Next hole, let's go. Hello guys. Welcome back to the channel. Part two, smash the cash. Monday night, we're back. The back nine at Monte Rey. And what a monster it is to start a 430 yard par four. Hopefully, we can just drill one towards that bunker. We shouldn't have too far in. Light breeze. But anyway, more importantly, the smash the cash meter, as you can see, is on a hundred pound. And I started with double, double. So hopefully we can get a good back nine I would love that to be about 220 quid by the end. That would be the goal. So sit back, relax, get a beer, tell the missus you're busy. Let's play some golf. Damn, Daniel. If I knew anywhere where the green was. Oh no. Right, we've had a bit of a beast. It's good to have got me a friggin' Jurassic Park hat on. In here's a bit of rattlesnake, guys. It's a great rattlesnake. Right, we've got 147. I don't know if I can get a wedge over this tree. There. Perfect. Woo! Let's go! Up and down for a par savesies. I'll just, to be fair, as long as it's not a double, I don't really mind. Please, Twin! Spin! I'll tell you what, I'll take it. It's about six foot past. The connection, the little nip off the grass. How are we doing anyway? Are we enjoying the series? What do you think about the idea? Because I kind of love the, I, this money idea because it, it gives me a meaning of playing it and I get a birdie. I get excited for the birdie, but I also get excited because 30 quid. And then I literally cannot wait for four weeks time when one of you lot come and play me for this pot. And believe it's bring your A game. But if I win, it rolls over. Can you imagine? Come on! Now nah, it's going in this. What a par this would be. And what a start at the back nine. It did turn. It turned. I thought visually it had to turn, but that stupid aim point said it was friggin' straight. Never mind, it's a bogey, it's not a double bogey. Minus 10 quid, we're back to 90. But like I said, it's better than a double. Oh, right, absolute beast of a par three. 180, 194 the pin. Got five iron. Big five iron as well. Be, be the club. Be the club. Oh! Is there no one else? Is that what? What? 195 yard par five, put it at eight foot. Go on in. Go on in for the bird. Get in! Love golf. Come on! For the bird. All right, come on. For the birdie. If not, safe as houses par. Oh, it didn't move. I honestly thought I was going to sneak in right and left, but... But look, 200 yard par three. 12 foot putt. Take that all day. And to par, 20 quid in the meter. Par four, it's not the longest. And we seem to play a lot better when we just play sensible. So, in the day, I want to score well. I want you to get money in the pot. I'm just going to hit a drive nine, my three iron, straight up the bunkers, really. Oh, what a lovely, lovely, lovely golf shot that is. Ball flight, everything just. Pew. What a club, by the way. What I did is, got the Stealth UDI 3 iron, so it's more forgiving, and then bent it to a 2 iron. Loft. Forgiveness. Oh, I'm a genius. 115. Do we go for it with a full gap wedge? Be the club, be the club. Stop. A little bit of spin. Leave myself a little 10 foot putt. If a few of these puts dropped and I hadn't have started so badly, we'd be about three over. Come on, two put par, 20 quid in the pot. Come on. Right, here we go. For the bird. Birdie. But I'll take the, I will take a par. Uphill. Come slightly down. Come on. Oh, 
Oh no, I've hit it too hard. That flew that. It just needed a little knock to the top of that hill and it would have just trickled down. And I've absolutely launched one straight at it. How did that turn? It's turned after it! <laughs> don't do it to Pro V, don't do it to Pro V. What a great hole, nice bogey anyway. I really like bogeys. Sorry guys, minus 10 pound. We're back to 100 quid, man. Par four this. I'm not being funny, it's, we can get well down there with driver. It's that hole as well where you hit into the green. It's a lovely hole. Oh, it's caught the bank. That is going to be colossal. I really, really need to get some paws in. What a hole, by the way. We're going to have a look at the second shot. Put that down there. What about that for a view? Look at the top. We've hit the drive. It's caught the bank. 345 yards that went. All right, Bryson. Roll, roll. In. <sighs> Could be 30 quid on the meter. 345 yard drive, little chip, play it in the bank, let it roll out, you know how it is. Where's that drinks cart? Drinks! I think if I just roll it over this patch of grass and it has to go in. <laughs> no, man, I've just... What was, what, what was that? Oh no, it's a par, but that could have been 30 quid. Oh, well, I think we're back to 120 quid. I'm not, I'm not angry, I'm just disappointed. <laughs> what a hole this is, by the way. Just have a look at that. It's got the lake, it's got mountains, it's par three. It's par three, it's like its own grounds. Right, we've just found my ball. I was devastated because I thought I put it in the water. Turns out it's here. I haven't got it. What's that? Imagine a crocodile just came out of that swamp. Right, here we go. Guys, guys, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that kind of stuff. Oh, I'm just going to stab at it and try and make bogey to be honest with you. Oh, where is it? Please tell me it's clo- What? It's coming back. It's coming back. It's Come on. It's Come on. Yeah. Yes! I love golf. What a roller coaster of emotions that is. I can't believe I just got up and down from Jurassic Park. What the hell? 20 quid in a meter. Yes! Right, off the back of an absolute crazy par. Here we are, par four, not too long. So I'm gonna go seven wood. I've played one, get down. Get down. Yeah, it's probably about 170 in, but safe shot, there's water all down the right. Literally stream running all down right. So any kind of fairly slicey one, you're gone. 166 to the pin, we've got a flight, 147, we've got a, we've got a flat, I'm gonna hit a seven line. The wind is off the left, so I've got, I've got to aim at the bunker, really. Hold. Hold. On the green. Yeah. <laughs> that is flirting, by the way. We are flirting. If I can go paw paw on, the, on these two holes, that is some solid golf. And more importantly, it's more money in that meter. By the way, do you like this format? Because I, I honestly love it. I absolutely love it. I just love it. I love the fact that the pot's going up. We're going to do loads of challenges and stuff. Makes it more interesting. Gets you guys involved. Two put is the goal for the par. Two put. Hit the bank. It's not bad, you know. It is bad, I'm not gonna lie. Damn, Daniel. Gutton! Pa, 20 quid, stick it on the roller. Pa, pa. 
two very different paths. Just please turn around and look at this. You know what I love about this course? Every hole, like the par three, actually that's three holes. The par four is like down a cliff. There was cliffs like left and right. It was just that hole we were playing. You leave that hole, go around a corner. The par three had its own like identity, left that hole, came with this hole. We can't see any other holes. Just play this one. Then we're going to go up here to the next hole. Like every hole has been like carved out of the mountains. That's why I think this course is rated so highly and people love playing it because so far, even like the, pot, the second one, the third hole, par fives and stuff, the par threes, everything just seems to have its own bit of land. Mental, mini, mini, mental, mini, mini, mental, mini, mini, mad. Next hole, let's go. Par five, monster, into wind, 608 yards. Gotta go, go! I can't see, but I think that I couldn't hit that any better. It's probably got in the wind, about 260. We're gonna have a full three wood and a probably a full wedge into the green. Yeah, probably three wood, three wood, if I'm sure. But look at that, again, another hole with its complete own identity. Ooh. Oh, I've just muckied the trainers. Absolutely gone. Literally, driver in the wind's gone 250. <laughs> We've now pitched out of that bloody stupid hazard. Probably would have been better hitting three wood and then three wood. But we didn't. Bring it on the green, give myself a, a par put. That is a great strike, guys. Jesus. Yeah, should have got 100 in. Here we go. Yeah, bit bash. To an 85 yard pin, it's gonna get the wind. Oh, sit, sit. That's lovely. We're gonna run out with this bloody divot juice, aren't we? Right, I've got one putt for par. Can we make it? Yes, we can. Right, not gonna lie, I have given myself an absolute chance, by the way. Oh, oh, I was a bit, after the last few putts, I got a bit scared. Look, it's a bogey. It's minus a tenner. But it could have been a lot worse, and the scorecard's still not massively damaged. Especially after that second shot. Again, though, another hole where you can't see any other holes. <laughs> Literally. Every hole's got its own, like, mountains. It's mental. Just going to throw it out there. I don't know why I'm doing this, but just throw it out there. But... We're on 79, we're seven over. The back nine, we've had a good run. Back nine, we've had one, two, three bogeys and the rest pars. Unbelievable par save on the par three. That was unlucky. Nearly had a bird, I've, I've missed a few birdie putts. Two pars for a 79. And please remember, we started double, double. <laughs> so we've actually played decent since the third hole. So I'm actually devastated that then first two holes but par par 79 or look if i make a bogey we'll shoot 80 still a hell of a score around here i love how i say i need two pars to break 80 and the first par four is 445 yards <laughs> best drive of the day well it felt the best just right that bunker literally perfect come on 136 to carry the bunker Go. Oh. Guys, a beetle. Mm. Come on. 79. Could it be on the cards? Two put par. Could birdie it. Cash pot's there. I'm enjoying myself, not gonna lie. I've had one birdie, I think. I've had no real birdies drop on par fours or par threes. Pulled it. Oh. Oh, I've had a few of them today for birdie, man. It's birdie putts. Look, it's safe pass, 20 quid in the pot. Could have been th oh, could have been on a 78 there and going down the last. 18th, Monty Ray, par five. And all we need is a par for 79. Come on, 30 quid extra if I break 80. So it could be a 50 quid all this. Come on. Well, that could give me a very 
daring shot in. That's going to be like on the board of like a par five, it's like 180. And you're like, do I go for it? There's water everywhere. But we're going to have to, aren't we? Let's go. This is that shot I was on about par. We've got to go for it, obviously. It's 165 to clear the water. It's a par five. This could be a birdie chance. Got a seven iron. Please put this somewhere on the green. Go on, guys. We've got this. We have got this. No, it's cleared it. It's not on the green. No. That was the chance. Eight iron. <sighs> Drop two, play three. Don't go in the bunker. Shot mate! <laughs> anyway, that's a Ben. 18th, Monty Ray. One putt par, two putts for the bogey. Oh, he's died in it a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go, the, let's go and count up how much cash we got. We messed up on the last, but here we are back on the balcony, by the way. This is our room. I'll show you around, around the room in another video. There's the water. There's the water. We put our final shot in for 80. We made double bogey and shot 81. 81, and there's 160 pound in the pot. That, to me, is a good start. If you imagine we have four of them, that'd be 160, 320. Jesus, that's like 640 quid, and that's without any challenges, any matches, nothing. So yeah, 160 quid is in the pot. Monty Ray, break 80, smash the cash, done. Hope you enjoyed it, get in the comments. Let's go.